welcome back. This is Shea Empowered and I'm Bernadette and today I'm standing behind me there's the Discovery, the Leeds Discovery Centre and it's very exciting today because we managed to get an appointment and we're going to be shown um, some very old pieces of cross stitch and embroidery. <laughs> This must be very old. Yeah, the light certainly affected the print this stitches. Just about, see the letter. This is this one, so this is from 1763. Oh, wow. It's amazing. Work on by Anne Noel, aged 11. 11? 11. Can you turn it around so we can see the back of it? Yeah, I'm just, just curious. Thank you. It's very nice at the back. So she, she was yeah, very yeah. talented. It's neat, isn't it? It's very neat. Yeah, you don't uh -huh. have them at the back of my work. And my friends may may have may have when I am, I am dead, dead and, and laid in the grave. Oh, Hannah, Hannah Brooke is my name, and with my needle, needle. The same year as our Lord, 1775. Yeah. Jeez. Wow. With the same wording. Yeah. Year of... Oh, this is 1777. Two years later. One year One later. Year. And the colour has stayed... Yes. Mm. Much better. Amazing. Than the first one we had. And a year earlier, 1775. Each other? 1812. Yeah. And Maywood. I work Used. freehand. Oh wow! Yes, because somehow I, um, the hope just gets in the way. Yeah. I find it gets in the way. This and I'm faster with my. Uh -huh. Yeah, without yeah. the hope. Yeah. <laughs> this work I've done to let you see what care my parents took of me. Oh. So nice. Oh. I can't days. say any exactly. <laughs> children that I visited this morning do this. Exactly. <laughs> what a pity. Age 10. Nothing. The embroidery colours are still very, very intact. And Christ, that's fine work. Cross stitch, but we can't figure out the count number. That's very fine. Very. That, that's that, I've never seen anything like that. Wow. <laughs> and it is still cross stitch. It is. It's, it not, is. it's not a satin stitch, it's actual. No, no, it is cross stitch. An actual cross stitch. Oh, okay. I can read for this. New family, you know, is in Leeds, so yeah, yeah. 1942 and all the names. But I've seen this that done looks, with that looks like it was made yesterday or something. Mm. 
but I've seen this may I've seen this kind of done with um, family reunions and all the yeah. families kind of sign it on pencil and then later it's all embroidered. embroidered. Yeah, oh. it's like a, a different way to do a family tree. Um, yeah. I was thinking about doing something similar with my my oh. mum's signature and my like the family members who are alive just to kind of that have the name nice. and dates written on. That is so. nice. That's a great idea. Eighteen oh two. like black work not lost at this kind of I think it's it's got mixed mixed stitches mm. because it's I got like the, long I li stitch. yeah I like yeah. these stitches here yeah. this is costage I think yeah. isn't it yes that is nice too yeah. what is it called uh, black work black work yeah. okay that I wasn't aware a of a friend of mine um, does a lot of black work um, so just type it in, you'll see. Okay. You'll see the different designs and the different. This is a, a collar. We saw a jacket in um, Headley, and it had something like this, but around. So it was a denim, and then they yeah. put that around the collar. It looked really good. Wow. That is nice. Mm. Yeah, it's, it's like, like a, ribbon. a ribbon that's been oh, gives it a three dimension. Yeah. Yeah. I'm guessing there's a date there. That's just when it's accessioned into the oh, okay. Okay. A variety of embroidery stitches again. Mostly long stitch. I've taken inspiration from maybe a magazine or something they've saw to create something themselves. And well, what what would have gone in the middle? You know? That's looks oh, look at the date. Nearly as well. finished. This looks like the same person, isn't it? Yeah. Yes. Possibly. So we're looking at nineteen twenties, you're yes. saying. Gee, yeah. that's beautiful. The other one would look more nineteen twenties, isn't it? Because of yeah, the circles like and stuff like more the, the, nouveau, yeah. The yeah. Freestyle. Wow. That's good though. That's very good. And once again it's on linen. But I, I can't uh, remember yeah. what it is. I've, I've seen, I've seen this work. Is this, this isn't complete, is it? No, so this is from the 1920s and it's a, a lace uh, collar and cuff set that we've got. Right. And the matching? Oh. Of course. Cuff, yeah, matching. Oh my goodness. What year would this be? Let me have a look, I'll be able to tell you. Trying to find a little black number. There we are. Oh, no period. No period. Matt. Circular silk embroidered mat, coloured flowers on black ground, pink and yellow fringe. Doesn't it? I like to crochet. Oh yeah, crocheting is beautiful. I love it. And I, it's a nice break from cross stitch because yeah. you see the work going up it's so, so quickly. Quick. Yes. I took a break Where from is cross, cross stitch, stitch so slow? Cases. So everyone what? had a um, pocket watch. Oh. So these would have been hung up by the side of the bed and you would hang off your pocket watch. Oh, so these okay. are all there. Uh, this is all beading. Yeah. I've never done beading either. I, I don't think I've got the patience to do <laughs> Well, if you have the patience to do cross stitch. Yeah. <laughs> I guess you can do anything if you do cross stitch <laughs> in reality. A needle case A from... A needle case. Let me have a look. That must be... Mm. 
late 19th century. Oh, wow. It's a needle case. Oh. <laughs> and if you open it up, can you... Is there needles in it? Or is it what's just like a little it? felt. Ah. Where you can... Felt where you can... Would have been oh, what's the date on? Store, the yeah. date is where you no, got it delivered. No, this is when it was accessioned into the... Yeah. Into the collection. It's like a little book. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice as well. So this crochet book is from... The first series. Oh. Can I? Yeah, you can open it up. You've got the gloves on. This is from 1851. The first page should tell you. Oh, yeah. Do you want to help a little bit? Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Yeah, 1851. Simkin, Marshall and Co. There you go. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Whereas I just learnt off the internet. We all do yeah, now. we all do now. <laughs> <laughs> but you do appreciate something like that. Oh, you God, yes. Oh, well, there's a colour, I think. Mm -hmm. okay. But that's some cro crochet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah so. Point de guise. That's the type of this Yeah, in yeah. I don't do anything that fine. No, me neither. No, 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 me neither. Baby blankets, jumpers. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That kind of level we're at. <laughs> me too. Because I need a needle case. So as well as... Uh, Is it in leather? Is that leather? It's probably mm, just be. a painted... It's made to look like a little bottle. Yeah, it says the lady's companion on the side. Because as well as so needlework, true. you have all the accessories to go with needlework. Yeah. <laughs> I love buying things. <laughs> Another old sewing box. So is that there? Is that bone or? So this is. What's that? No idea. <laughs> it, feel, it doesn't know. feel like bone. No, I don't think so. But I think it's like an aid de memoir that you could write on and, and then, then remove. So then that's bone, thimble. isn't it? On there. Yes. The card almost looks like that as well. And that's pen That's knife. a knife, we're not going to get that out. No. And there's your little, your pins there, yeah. little travelling, wow. little travelling set. <laughs> yeah. It's so nice. We've got one at home made out of plastic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow. It is a little bag, evening oh. bag for a lady, a little purse. Oh my goodness, that is so cute. That is so cute. Oh, nice. wow. Yes, very nice. What would you put in there? 1826 purse. And that is cross stitch again, is it? Uh, it's a mix. It's a mix of. It should be all cross stitch, yes. Actually, the grey bit. So is that just print, is it? Or? The grey, which grey? These grey bits. The grey? Yeah. No, it's not print, babe. No, no, no. Quite a lot of the dull. Um, does it show up like the dull picture? silver threads would have been a silver thread? Mm. I'll show you some of the dress and textile okay. collection and some of the threads just tarnished over time. So where there would have been like a really bright silver, silver thread, they've they've just gone to a, a really dull colour. Okay. What are those? Any ideas what these might be? We've had a good look. Mm, no, made no out idea. Of wood, and these are called knitting sheaths. So you could go under your arm, and it's an extra needle so your needle would come out and if you're clever enough you can knit hold your needle knit a needle and as you knit you can hold it under your your arm so there's different oh. designs this one looks to be homemade because as you can see en in en have engraved the the name and the initials oh, wow. onto their and and what needle. what 1842 oh. yes 1842 Different materials, wow. these are wood, but we also have them in um, early plastics and also um, animal bones. Okay. So it's just giving you a, a helpful hand for when you're knitting. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so again, taking you through the different stages of producing the, the finished piece. Wow. What year was this? This. I think it hasn't 
front page, I would think. Mm, it doesn't. Let's go with it on our list. Price, 2D. Weldon's. What would that mean? Pence. Pence. <laughs> Tell us. <laughs> so this is a square rule, but we also have sections cut out for creating darts, darts. in clothing, oh. and where you need to line up the the neck or armholes um, to create your um, dress pieces. Amazing. A little bit. Let's see if I can find. That's the same sort of technique as the old As a what? As we went from before. Well. You've got a mixture, a mixture of, of, of different embroidery stitches. The flowers are very stitches. well. Yeah. I'm definitely going to have to get this out when we do our introduction to embroidery. It's to show beautiful. the different stitches. Yes, yes, it's beautiful. Once again, it's that work. It's like la lace, or it I think it's a type of lace, X which I can't remember the name of. It's like sexy nightwear, isn't it? <laughs> you old, you this is the adults, yeah, this is gentleman's outfit. So we've got a waistcoat from 1790, and you can see you've got the, the colourful spangles, or the sequins as we would call it and on the buttons that dark thread would have been one silvered so in the candlelight you were showing off your wealth and status through oh. your clothes so under the candlelight the um the green spangles and the silver thread would kind of glisten oh. so it's all hand embroidered at this stage it's all handmade and it's a man's as well this is a man's yes this is a man's so fashion's completely wow. changed because a man wouldn't wear that well, no. well, well, maybe, <laughs> maybe. Depending. I bet I'm going back again. Wow, that is beautiful. Nice. That's very nice. That's beautiful. Um, so this is the the outer dress. So underneath here, you would have your layers of shifts. You would have your um, corsets on. You would have your like the stays, your undergarments. Underneath the dress, you would have a um, a skirt with a, a different material, a matching kind of colour palette. This would go on and then you have a stomacher, like the mm. triangular piece that was normally okay. embroidered and then you would be kind of So they, they would get it. the cloth delivered, wouldn't they? So the cloth would have been made by some kind of machine. Yeah, so this is um, silk, so we think like from Spitali Spitalfields down in London. Right. And it would have been brought to the dressmaker and made and made for the person. So it's all handmade. So the, the stitches on the inside where no one would say, apart from you and your dresser, yeah. they don't have to be as neat because no one's <laughs> gonna say that. Okay. <laughs> but you definitely need someone to sew you into your clothes. Um, and again, your wealth and your social status was shown through what you were wearing. So a little bit later, we've got 18, that looks like a 20s. Night. Um, it's not. No. It's an evening dress. Evening oh. dress. So this is um, think um, Pride and Press, uh, Pride, Pride and Prejudice, Prejudice. Jane yeah. Austen. Yeah. So you've got like the little empire line under the bust, um, a little bit more free flowing and fitted, but again, it's still like, the same high era. class. No, it's about a, a dec decade later. Decade later. Beautiful. And on the the sleeves, you've got these little decorative Beautiful. puffs for little. Ah. Oh dyes that you might find in nature mm. you have um chemical dyes so you have like a, an influx on really bright garish i've got a shirt colors. i've got a shirt that's similar colors. kind yeah, of yeah, yeah, from, yeah. material the fabric's a bit more recognizable here yes wow. and uh, there's also a process um with the silk, you could dip it in a tin solution. It kind of strengthens and stiffens the silk. Yeah. So you're able to attach more embellishments, so more ruffles, more kind of pleats. 
that definitely looks like something from the Titanic movie, that, yeah, for yeah, sure. Yeah. And then we head up into the, the 1920s in this that, boxy that again you style. Recognize, yeah. Okay. The 1920s, yeah. 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 The Flapper Girls. Yeah. Um, my favourite is this red dress here. You're, you see it and like they're iconic when you think of movies, you know. And it, oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's made for dancing. There's a lot yeah, of movement yeah, in yeah. it. One here. Oh, yeah. oh. There's a wedding dress from 1961. 1961. 1961. Okay. So white, white line, white nylon, and three quarter length, and you've got the, you've got the neck. The headdress. Yeah. And the headdress. Oh, nice. And it's got um, mother of pearl in there. Mother of pearl. Mother of pearl, kind of. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. From the shell itself. Or? Uh, no, this is like synthetic. Oh. But as people are donating items to us. So we want to know who's donated it, oh, okay. um, where they wore it, um, why they bought it, was it for an occasion, so we want oh. to kind of add the story of the item. Yes. It's a miniature version, so it still, it still works, we haven't threaded the needle, but as you can see, the children were able to, to practice their sword skills. Oh. 